Gardening is America's number one pastime, and if you're looking for ideas for your own garden, the OSU Botanical Gardens are packed with inspiration. They're the studio gardens for the statewide television show, Oklahoma Gardening, but they're also open during daylight hours for anyone prone to strolling or studying. A lot of people don't even know that it's here. That's true, something I find, it's sort of a hidden treasure. It's amazing what you can learn on an amble through the garden, especially when your tour guide is a garden show host. One of the really interesting things for our visitors is just the variety of plant material. And a lot of it's labeled and they could come and learn new plants. Um, and one of those gardens is the uh, Oklahoma Proven Garden, which is all plants that have been selected because they do well in Oklahoma. So that's a nice place for, for visitors to start getting ideas. Uh, we have two different collections of perennials. We have a sun perennial garden and this is the shade perennial garden. There's a, a wide variety of shrubs and, and herbaceous plants that do really well in the shade. And so it's nice to have a place where they're all demonstrated and you could see just the variety of different plants that'll do well in those situations. Don't miss the whimsical children's garden or the Japanese garden. This is our herb garden and we have several different beds in here and they all have a different theme. Uh, one of them is plants that have a nice aroma. This garden has plants that you could use for dye and this is our salad garden. So it's just a lot of fun uh, to demonstrate different uses of plants as well. There's also a water garden, a patio garden, and acres of design elements, from water features to walkways. Landscape students from nearby Oklahoma State University bring their fresh ideas to life in this garden, so it is ever-changing. There's always something new to look at, and uh, even people who you know, garden for a living are always really delighted to walk around through our gardens. And those of us who don't yet garden will feel the itch to get started on an oasis of our own. In Stillwater, I'm Shell Wagner.